Okay, so week two of fitness. Hopefully you had a go at the workouts last week. So here we've got something quite similar for you in the second week of it. Now, the Hodge Hill workout this week is an AMRAP 20. AMRAP means as many rounds as possible in that 20 minutes. So you do one round and you do, and from there you do as many more you can in the time frame. So you'll need a stopwatch to count down 20 minutes so you can count how many rounds you do. Now for this, it's gonna be four exercises in the round. So the first is tuck jumps, so that's double feeted uh, tuck jumps, trying to get your knees up nice and high. Then you're gonna do 10 star jumps, legs wide, arms wide, and then 10 mountain climbers. That's when you're in a press up position and you are literally just running your legs up. So your knees are trying to get up to your chest. You can YouTube this if you wanna find out what the movement looks like, okay? And that's what a mountain climber is. And then just like last week, burpees. We all love our burpees. So. What you're going to do is find out how many rounds did you do in the 20 minutes. So every time you do a round, get a little piece of paper or whiteboard, mark off a round so you can count it. Have a go maybe two, three times in the week, see if you can beat your score. Again, just like last week, check your pulse rates before and after, see how hard you worked. And then you can let us know how you were doing, record this on a sheet of paper and upload it to class charts. Now, second part of it will be the next Joe Wicks workout. So this one is called Full Body Beginners Hit. Okay, so there's gonna be some upper body stuff, so some press ups, things like that. And then there's gonna be some lower body with the squats, lunges, and different things. So it's a full body workout in about 20 minutes to half an hour. Okay, so that's the second thing that you can have a go at, and the link for that will be on class charts, so the link to YouTube. And then the third thing is finishing off your Snowden step challenge. Yeah? So hopefully you had a go at this last week, hopefully you started it, hopefully you're keeping a tally of how many steps that you've taken and how many that you have left to do this week. Okay. So you had to remember it's 354 ups, so 708 up and downs. Yeah. So think about how many you did last week, how many that you've still got to do this week, whether you're doing that with um, a family member, mom, dad, whatever, how many more you've got to do, and let us know if you completed the step challenge.